What's up, friends? So today we're going to be talking about a sequel about a lesson I just put up on YouTube not too long ago called How to Impress Your Girlfriend. And a lot of you guys were like, I don't know why you'd want to impress your girlfriend with your plan. It was just a joke, guys. Like I, I was telling, saying so many times we're playing and we think we're doing something super complicated that will impress someone, namely maybe a significant other that we're trying to impress. But in matter of fact, they're never impressed by it unless we pull it off musically, right? So this is going to be how to completely blow your girlfriend away, right? Or boyfriend or boyfriend. So let's get to the question of the lesson. Question of a lesson is going to be, who is your favorite? Speaking of females, who is your favorite female drummer? This isn't sexist. There's just some killer female players out there. And I want to know who your favorite is. Maybe there's some that I don't know that I need to check out. It can be because of their playing. It can be preferably not because of their looks, but it can be because of their playing. That's what we want to stick to with this. Okay. Um, now, this is going to be a variation off of that last lesson, how to impress your girlfriend or boyfriend. Um, a lot of you were like, impress my girlfriend. First step, get a girlfriend. Uh, that is the first step. And, and admitting you have a problem is admitting that you don't have a girlfriend. Uh, but once you get that girlfriend, how do you impress her, right? How do you blow her away? Well, let's take that pattern we discussed last time, which was a dotted eighth note pattern. And we took and we did some beat displacement with it. So if we're here, one and two and three, this was our pattern. One E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three E and a four E and a one E and a two E and a three and a four E and a one and two. So it takes three beats or three measures to resolve that. And we put the accent on every more uh, other one of those and made a beat out of it and took that beat and made it seem like, hey, as I drop my stick, I'm a professional, don't worry, I know what I'm doing. Uh, <laughs> made it seem like we were slowing down, but in fact, we're just playing with the time. We're just displacing the time uh, by putting the emphasis on another beat. Um, so let's take this and instead of starting it on the downbeat, Let's do something that's a simple move, but that completely changes the way it sounds. Let's start this rhythm on the upbeat. So if we're here, one and two and three and four, and we're going to start it on the upbeat of one, and it will resolve on the upbeat of one. So one and two and three and four and one and two and three a four e and a one e and a two e and a three and a four e and a one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one and two and three and four and one two again three four one and e and a three and a four e and a one e and a two e and a three and a four e and a one e and a two e and a three e and a four e and a one and that's where you would crash and come back in with two on the downbeat. Now the groove we were doing was one on the kick drum. Two and, or, uh, two and four on the snare drum, and then three and the upbeat of three on the kick drum. That's the groove we're going to be doing, and we're going to take that and start it on the upbeat and uh, basically displace that beat and s blow your girlfriend or your boyfriend away with your rhythmic prowess, right? That's a, No, it's not, the, it's not the goal at all, but anyway, looking at it in joking terms. Um, speaking of something, uh, let me, I wanted to tell you guys, uh, I'm going to be offering two new sub subscription models. Uh, when I say sub subscription, that sounds, but two new lesser subscription models that give you access to parts of the video vault that I have on my website. Let me say real quick, one's going to be the World Rhythms Lab. One's going to be for the gigging drummer. The World Rhythms Lab is strictly going to be hundreds of videos on world rhythms. The mambo, the samba, reggae, even drum and bass I'm going to put in there. Jazz, which is a fusion of different things. That's an American world rhythm. Uh, the huapango. We're, I mean, we're going through tons of these. Songo, soca. And I have a ton of videos already in there. You'll get one new video a week. There's no live component to it. So you just get a new video. You get to go watch it whenever you want to. Sheet music with every lesson. It's going to be 10 bucks. Super cheap. If I, when I was a kid coming up, if somebody would have said all the research I had to do on these world rhythms, if they would have said, hey, for $10, you can check out any video on, on any world rhythm from a teacher that understands what he's talking about, I'd have been like, yes, please. Not the $50 I just paid that dude for an hour, <laughs> four times a month. The other one's going to be for the gigging drummer. That's going to be focused on drum covers. Okay, so... Tons of popular songs. By the time you work through all those, you will have a big enough set list to start a cover band if you want to and actually start making some money. It's also going to be how to chart a song quickly in one listen, how to tune your drums, um, how to play on another drummer's drum kit, things like that, how to deal with a, with a major label, how to deal with an indie label, how to deal with a manager. Things like that will also be included in that. That'll be $10 too. And again, no live component, 
just one new lesson a week um, for you to check out with a PDF download. Both of those will be $10. And then we'll still have the live lessons. The live lessons are going to be going up to $20 uh, here pretty soon. So if you want to get in for the seven-day free trial and have it at $18.99, lock that price in, you should go ahead and subscribe now uh, before Christmas. Uh, anyway, back to the lesson. I'm sorry, I, I meant to tell you guys that at the beginning of the lesson. Back to the lesson. So now let's start this groove. So we're going to we're going to take and, and displace that groove I just played for you, but we're going to start it on the upbeat. Okay, here we go. So that's going to be the full displaced beat right there, starting on the end of one. Again, that's a very small change, but it changes the rhythm completely, and you're not hitting uh, on those same subdivisions you were before. So it just is a different feel to something that um, you were already doing uh, to kind of confuse the ear, but at the same time, know what you're doing, and as we all know, impress your significant other, right? That's what drumming's all about, impressing people. <laughs> not at all. Um, Hopefully that helps you guys out. I'm looking forward to releasing these new subscription models. They will be out very, very soon along with some other cool announcements. So keep watching. We'll talk to you soon.